And we're going to do a Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine reading. And it's going to be a longer reading. Let me know in the comments if you enjoy these longer readings. Or you prefer the reels. Or you don't care. <laughs> okay. Divine Feminine. Ten of Wands. This is about caring too much. And it's about learning to say no. Learning to put yourself and self-care first. Um, this is about burning out. Perhaps you're doing something that's in your passion. Because wands do have to do with passions. But you're doing too much. Um, wands is a fire energy. And remember that too much you can fire can burn so it's it's um you're burned out basically it's what it's saying i'm getting a strong pull to go into nature and you will recharge for some of you um there's a message here for gardening i'm getting that and uh the tens have to do with completions of cycles. So this energy is just waiting for you. It's just waiting for you to, to learn the lesson of putting yourself and your body and your mind first. Because the more you feed yourself, the more you could give to others. So it is about learning to say no. Divine Masculine. Divine Masculine, um, there is a new offer, an opportunity. This could come in the form of a message. And um, I'm getting a strong pull to tell you to slow down and take the time to look at that side of you that is yin energy that is soft that is intuitive some of you may even be psychic or if you've been considering the studying some sort of intuitive uh, uh, belief metaphysics astrology or something spiritual or even the tarot this is a strong indicator that yes this is a good calling and it's also about being open and flexible and giving yourself the time to learn to the the page is still quite young so this could be being quite young at something quite um uh like you still have a lot of learning to do so if this has to do with a new um subject that you're studying give yourself a break because you you'll grow into it you you will definitely um, learn and grow so the page and then we have the knight and then the king of cups so this person is not quite in their king energy, but they're learning, and learning is part of the journey. Let's see. Um, I also get the strong pull of being calm emotionally, but really going within and, and being okay with that part of yourself that is intuitive, that that knows there's something more and um, and to embrace it that that silly young uh, maybe maybe you tossed logic to the side for a little bit because you just chose to follow your intuition and your heart kind of message here so anyway that's what I'm getting for you guys with these two and I don't see anything else that was my message this is lily hummingbird tarot and i wish you guys the very very best see you soon